Hello developers, in this video tutorial I am going to teach you how to get and display current date and time using JavaScript. Yes, I am going to share the JavaScript program to display current date and time. Let's see how to do it. As you can see that I have already posted an article about this topic on my blog codingdiksha.com. I have also shared this article link on the video description. I am going to use Visual Studio Code as a code editor. I have already created a folder called JavaScript for this project. As you can see that there are no files inside this folder. Okay, now I am going to create a new file and save the file as index.html. Don't forget to uh, choose save as type as all files. Yeah, right. Now I am going to create some basic HTML codes like uh, head section, body section. I successfully created that. Now I am going to replace the HTML title as JavaScript program 2 display current date and time. That's it. Okay. In JavaScript, there is a function called date, which is used to uh, get and display the current date and time, right? You can see that in this code, I just declared a very new variable called today to the function date, new space date, right? It will return the current date and time. You have to uh, put this code inside the body section, not uh, inside the body section, inside the script tag, right? Yeah. I'm going to use document.write to display the data in, in the HTML web page. Document.write Inside the function you have to uh, assign the variable to display the value. Now I'm going to run this project. As you can see that it is displaying the current date and time. In uh, you can see that Friday, October 29, 2021. It is in 24 hours format. Time is time is in 24 hours format. 18:34:30 GMT plus 5:30 Indian Standard Time. Right. Now I am going to uh, teach you something. Uh, some actually there are so, so many methods available uh, in the date function. Get full year function is used to get the year as four digit number like 2021, 2020. Get month, get month function is used to get the month as a number. As you can see that there are, there is only uh, 0 to 11, not 0 to 12. January means 0, February means 1. Same like that uh, December means 11, but we have to get the value as 12. So we have to add one uh, to get the actual result. Get date function is used to get the day as number 1 to 31 like normally. Uh, get hours function is used to get the hour in 24 hours format 0 to 23. Get minutes is used to get the minutes. Get seconds is used to get the seconds. Get milliseconds function is used to get the milliseconds. Then get time. It is used to get the time in milliseconds since January 1, 1970. I will show you uh, how it is works. Then get day is used to get the weekday as number 0 to 6. Uh, Saturday means 0, Sunday means 1, Monday means 2, uh, Tuesday means 3, uh, Wednesday means 4, Friday means 5. Right? Date not, date dot now function is used to get the time. It is available in ECMA script 5. Okay, let's move on to the tutorial. In the first heading, uh, I am going to get and display current date in JavaScript. For that, I declared a new variable called today to the date function, new date. Then uh, I declared another variable date to um, today dot, today means date function, today dot get full year. As I have already said that get full year is used to get the year as four digit number plus then uh, hyphen. 
instead of hyphen you can use any other symbols whatever you want then again plus symbol then today dot get month as i have already said that um, the get month uh, display the month as a number 0 to 11 if you want to display december as 12 then you have to add plus one right so i just add to this uh, function again hyphen then plus today dot get date today dot get date is used to get the day as number so it is displaying the format as 2021 then month 10 then 29 finally i use the document dot write to display the date and time i just copied this quotes and replaced it here i'm going to align the quotes i saved the file when i refresh the web page you can see that it is displaying the current date 2021 10 29 it is showing in reverse because i am using the code here as reverse only year month then date if you want to uh, display the date first then uh, month as second and the year as third then you have to use like this variable date one equal to I'm going to display the date first. So date plus single quotation hyphen again plus then I'm going to display the month. Then I'm going to display the year finally. That's it just replaced it here date one i successfully saved the file as you can see that when i re refresh the web page you can see that a date comes first then year comes last here you can see that 2019 2021 then i am going to show you how to get current time in 24 hour format using javascript you can see that uh, I declared a new variable today to the function new date. Then uh, I declared another variable time to uh, get the hours, minutes, and seconds equal to today dot get hours plus inside the double quotation colon plus today dot get minutes inside the double quotation colon plus today dot get seconds. Finally, I displayed the time using document dot write. I copied the code. I replaced it here. Please watch and listen carefully, then only you can understand. I successfully saved the file. Now I am going to refresh this uh, web page. As you can see, that it is uh, displaying the time in 24 hour format 18, 40, 20. That's it. If you want to display both, current, both date and time, then you have to uh, use this code. I copied the code and I replaced it here. Nothing new in that. Uh, I just uh, declared a new variable today to uh, get the date function. Then date equal to date dot get full year, get month, then get date. Then variable time equal to get hours, get minutes, and get seconds. Finally, variable date and time to uh, display the date and time. I just insert a date plus space plus time. Finally, I use the document dot write to display both date and time. That's it. Nothing new in that. As you can see that when I refresh the web page, you can see that it is displaying both date and time. But some people want to uh, display time in 12 hour format and some people want to display the uh, month as uh, text like Monday, Tuesday, Friday instead of number like 1, 2, 3, 12, right? Let's see how to do it. For that, you have to use one method that is dot to local string, right? Actually, there are uh, three methods available. The first one is dot to local string. Then another one is dot to local time string. And the third one is dot to local date string, right? 
dot two locale string is used to display both date and time but dot two locale date string is used to only display uh, to display the date only and dot two locale time string is used to display the time only right okay let's see how to do it as you can see that um, these are the locales you can see that en hyphen in which means indian english then hi hyphen in means hindi india right there are so many locates available ta hyphen india in means indian tamil that's it then uh, dot to local string options are date style time style as you can see that date style is used to uh, display the date as uh, full long or medium or short then time style then local matcher time zone hover 12 in default it is uh, true then hover cycle format matcher weekday year two digit or two digit or numeric if you set the year as two, two digit then it will display the 2021 as only 21 not 2021 if you set year as numeric then it will display the whole year 2021 then month two digit long narrow numeric short day two digit numeric hover minutes second time zone name let me teach how to use dot to local string i remove these quotes then i declare a new variable called date to new date dot to local string you can see that when i uh, insert the dot you can find the so many methods are available dot to local string now i am going to display that uh, date and time for that i am going to use document dot write when you don't specify the locale then it will uh, take your system's default locale right i have not specified any locale here inside uh, the function here you can see that it is empty it means it will uh, take your de default locale now i am going to refresh this page you can see that it is displaying the month 10 29 2021 then it is now displaying the time in 12 hour format 6 44 49 pm and i refresh you can see that 6 45 2 pm right for example if you want to uh, display the uh, date and time in tamil in india there is a language tamil if you want to display that in your uh, date and time in your language you have to specify the locale now i am going to specify this locale inside here inside the single quotation specify the locale then refresh the page you can see that uh, the language is changed to tamil right some people don't understand so i am going to use uh, the international language like uh, british english for british english i am going to use this locale and i just replaced it here i saved the file and i refresh you can see that it is changed to uh, 24 hours format 184604 because uh, british using the 24 hours format right but in india uh, we are using 12 hours format in us also we are using 12 hours format you, when i change in english okay you can see that the time will be changed to 12 hours you can see that 1846 when i refresh you can see 646 it is automatically changed to 12 hours format right so uh, depends on your usage you can use any locale you want now i'm going to uh, uh, teach how to use the dot to locale string options for example now i'm going to uh, display the year in two digit means 
I copied this. After the single quotation, specify a comma, then open an array. Inside that, I pasted here, then colon. When you put double quotation, you can find two options. That is two digit and numeric. Visual Studio Code is automatically suggesting that because I am using some useful extensions. Now I am going to display the year in two digit only. So when I save the file, when I refresh the page, you can see that it is displaying only 21. 21 means 2021. It is a year. Currently it is not displaying any other things like day, month and time because I just specified the option as year only. If you want month, then you have to specify the month here. Month colon double quotation. I'm going to display the month as long. Sorry. When I refresh the page, you can see that it is showing the month as uh, character, right? Word, October. Instead of number, it is showing October. Now I am going to get the day. So I have to use this day. That's it. When I refresh that, you can see that October 29, 2021. Like that, you can use any other options you want. You can use uh, time, like if you want the seconds in two digit, you can uh, use two digit. If you want the minute in two, two digit, you can use two digit. Hour, like that year, weekday, you can any other options you want that's it guys if you uh, still uh, have doubts about this topic uh, by, uh, sorry javascript program to display current date and time then feel free and uh, ask us via the command section we will help you if you want to receive uh, more videos about javascript then don't forget to subscribe this channel